In this short episode, I go over some just released information about the Olive Tree crossover event between Decrops and Splinterlands. If you're interested in this event and want to find out what's changed, please stand by. Hey all you splinterheads and decrop farmers, Bronze Dragon here bringing you an event update. Welcome back, thanks for dropping by. This update was just dropped in Discord by Script Kitty of Decrops, and I felt it was worth doing a short video on. So basically he has taken feedback from the audience, from uh, the audience of both Decrops and from uh, Splinterlands players who are interested in the cross uh, crossover event and made a few updates to what the event actually will be and the details. So I will leave the link as usual in the show notes so you can check out the article on Peak D. But basically here it is. Uh, it's an announcement that it's gonna go live and the sale will be live on Saturday, January the 20th at uh, 5.30 GMT which uh, here in the States in Eastern time, that's 12.30 uh, in the afternoon. Had to look it up. Uh, but uh, so that's when it goes live and you'll just have to convert it for whatever time zone you're in. Um, but the uh, takeaways here are that the olive tree has been buffed. Okay, so previously it was announced that it was only going to yield two olives per day. Now it's going to yield three olives per day and each olive is four shares each okay so if you're not familiar if you're from splinterlands and you're not familiar with how decrops works uh, uh, check out one of my previous videos this last week i explained how the situation works where you sell crops and you get shares and the shares net you a percentage of the overall season pot so that's how that's one way you can make uh your uh your money, so to speak, in game. So anyway, with that said, um, the yield of the tree has been buffed, okay? Now the next thing that he had heard back from uh, one of the other primary things about the game is the fact that uh, it works in seasons, just like real life works. So certain crops, just like in real life, only uh, when planted, they can only be planted and only yield in one season. There are some of the rarer crops and some of the more expensive crops that yield across two or three or four seasons, but generally speaking, most crops only yield across one season, right? The olive tree in and of itself is a spring tree. And uh, one of the changes he made is that um, people didn't basically didn't like the fact that they're going to buy a tree here and we're currently in fall in decrop season. And then they would not be able to use it for two, basically fall and winter, you would not be able to use that just bought tree. Um, so basically this first time around, if you buy some olive trees, um, you will be able to use immediately plant them and use them for the fall season, which we're in right now, and then the winter season, and then it rolls into spring. And after that, it will be a, a normal cycle. Then after that, you will only be able to use it in spring. Okay, so the other thing I wanna point out is, you will need your DEC in your Hive Engine account. It's 25,000 DEC per tree. That DEC is held at, pegged, uh, at peg and then they will be burning that. So they're not keeping the DEC. Um, and uh, you can buy up to four trees in one transaction. Now, overall, there's no limit of transactions you can do, but it's limited to four per transaction. Um, so there's that. So if you're interested, the takeaway here is have your DEC and Hive Engine ready to go and get them as soon as possible. I don't know if they're going to sell out. Uh, there's a thousand of them. So who knows? I do know that I was over on the, the Decrops um uh, uh, discord uh, for a while on and off this last week and it's a pretty popular topic there's lots of people especially people that are heavily invested in that uh, game that will be buying several so if you're from Splinterlands and you're interested in going ahead and checking out what Decrops is check out a couple of my videos uh, from the last week that I did on them um, I'm diving in I've bought some property um, and I'm getting in, in a little bit of time I do plan on buying some olive trees but I just want to get this information out uh, in case you're interested so get your DEC situation Situated and get ready for the 20th, um, depending on your time zone, um, 5.30 GMT. Be there, be square. This has been Bronze Dragon, and I will see you on the flip side. Mm -hmm.